Hello everybody, my name is Sean Hans the Gamer and today we'll be reacting to Zelda Gamer 456 video and it's called Twilight Princess Episode 1 Introduction. Now, this is something I wanted to do for about when I first started watching. Also, subscribe to Zelda Gamer 456. If not, I will find you. I will. If you don't think I won't find you. <laughs> Trust me, I have my ways. But anyways, ignore that. Just subscribe to Zelda Game Four Five Six. But without further ado, let's react to the video. And also, before we start thinking of making this like a series, like the Twilight Princess um, videos is like season one. And if um, she records Wind Waker, that would be like season two of my reaction videos. I know. The stuff I think of. Everyone at home is probably like... How much weed have you been smoking? Or what kind of drugs are you on? Which I'm not on any drugs. I've just down like a pixie stick. If you don't know what pixie stick is, it's basically sugar that has flavor to it. And I down and I just kind of had to like two of each kind eh <laughs> but yeah first of all you should have paused that just I should have paused that right there but the scenery in the background of that when he was crossing the bridge. He, I mean, he still is, but... Like, beautiful scenery. It's just a beautiful game and all. I mean, between this and, like, my favorite fa between this and Ocarina, those are, like, my two that are competitive over number one. Majora's not so much. Majora's more of a Legend of Zelda game where you rage and scream and want to just give up. What? Hey, what's up, you guys? And welcome to a brand new Let's Play called The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess HD. We are going to start a new one, so we're just going to delete this. I mean, you should go normal, and I'll play, I 
in a let's play because if you don't want to be like as dumb as I am and pl just go into a game, go on the high setting level, that will just bring me back to the glow hockey day um video. If you want to see that, that's in my channel. It's just yeah. Where I just immediately said, we're going in insane. But, no, 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 let's continue. Tell me, do you ever feel a strange sadness as dusk falls? They say it is the only time when our world intersects with theirs. The only time we can feel the lingering regrets of spirits who have left our world. Kind of depressing. That is why loneliness always pervades the hour of twilight. But enough talk of sadness. I have a favor to ask of you, Link. I was supposed to deliver something to the royal family of Hyrule the day after tomorrow. Yes, it was a task sent to me by the mayor, but would you go in my stead? You have. I want the. To Hyrule, right? The sword. In the kingdom of Hyrule, there is a great castle, and around it is Castle Town, a community far bigger than our little village, and far bigger than Hyrule is the rest of the god of the of the world the god created. You should look upon it all with your own eyes. Okay, look here. I like the color of Link's eyes. I wish I had those his like eye color. Just saying. His eye color is good. And like I know he's just a video game character. But like usually probably around his age I'm guessing he shouldn't look as flawless skin. He should at least have acne or something, but no. It's clean. That's kind of upsetting, though. I mean, he is like one of my favorite Nintendo characters in the universe. Also because he, he carries swords and I like swords. I like more of a melee melee fighting characters than range. I suck at range characters. Even though you have to use a bow in Legend of Zelda. Shot. And then throw freaking bombs. You can use, you can mainly use your sword. And that's cool. I like the game. And he's also left handed. And he uses his left hand to fight. I mean I can use both hands but I prefer using my right or my left. It is getting late. We should head back to the village. I will talk to the mayor about this matter. Let's just admire this music that's going on.
No, I... No, I have no sense. Yeah. Okay, this might be a stupid thing, but <laughs> if I was Link, I'd probably climb through the window. Get out that way. And then I don't know what else to do, because then I'll probably break my legs by jumping off the roof. Like a complete dingus I am. Okay, I have to give Zelda Gamer credit, though, for voice acting. It is really good. Like, if I was ever to voice act in a character in a game, it would suck because my my voice can only go deeper and deeper. It, I can't go any higher than this. I, I could try going higher, but then it would just sound like a mouse dying from, I don't know. I mean, I probably won't speak much too, even though this is a reaction video and I should be speaking 24 7. But that's not the case with me. Oh, hi, Link. I washed a pony for you. Link seems like he's always the happy person in the beginning. Then he usually has that like really hard, so I she a treat. Fuck you oh, but look listen, to him. Can you use a piece of grass to play that song for me? You know, the one that Apono likes. And that music usually was Annoy nice someone, but well, to me it's like. Okay. I do exact opposite of what Ilya told Link. Be like, go you freaking horse. If that was the move he would use, he would lose against a sword fight against me. Just one swift oh, hit Are with a katana and he's video? done for. I just closed the shop myself. I'm sure you know all about the mischievous monkeys that have been coming into the village lately. Those things worry me a bit. I'd better lock up tight here. I couldn't stand to have any more goods stolen. Can't trust that good for nothing husband to do anything right. Come on, Dad. You can't catch a silly little monkey. Uh. First of all, you saw how scrawny that man looks. Yeah, I bet he couldn't catch a monkey. The monkey would break his arms. 
Probably break his whole body. Guy is so scrawny looking. Sorry for yawning, guys. I'm somewhat tired. I fell asleep just listening to Metallica. Are they in the... Sure, <laughs> they southern? Like, who else do you oh, say... Oh, who else would say her them all okay. in? There's... That should do her. I normally suck I don't at this, know. but apparently I'm doing okay today. Carmen's gonna come back and bite me in the butt. Go, go, go! Yes! Did it. First try. That's actually not true. Link, Pono, oh much obliged to both of y'all. I can cover everything tomorrow without having to trouble you. So what is with his face? I mean, not to be rude to the graphics, but his face is just, oh my god. I mean, he looks pretty jacked, so if I were to laugh in real life t about his face, I would probably have to run at least... <laughs> Or try to run away from this man because if I don't, he's probably gonna beat me up with the with his jacked arms. Looks like he lift he could lift up the goats and just throw them in the barn. Just, just wait a spell, bud. I'll get them fence set up. Sorry that took so long. Okay then, y'all ride all you want. Y'all get tired of riding, just jump the gate and head back to the village, okay bud? Of course I'm lazy, and I don't want to jump fences all day, so we're just gonna jump and go. Gosh, I don't know why I'm so tired today. I was full of energy <laughs> through the whole time I was at school, and then I'm just like, got home, and I'm like, I don't want to do anything. Oh, demon baby. Hey, wake up, Link. It's morning already. Nope, not demon baby. That's definitely not the voice I imagined on him, but okay. Why not? Link has a bunch of pictures of his horse in his house. <laughs> he also has a pitchfork. Sorry. What? No. No. Okay, we already know what they're gonna talk about, but just so you guys know. Oh, Link, did you hear? We're selling a slingshot at the store right now. A slingshot! I wonder how powerful it is. Damn, baby. I must try it. Tallow, if you and Mel want it so badly, just buy it at my parents' shop. Did you see any rupees in my hand? I can't afford anything. Come on, Beth, can you just loan it to us for a while? You know I get in trouble for that. If you two want it, save up your allowances or something. 
But our announcements are terrible. Oh, I wish I was born to a family with a slingshot instead of one with a water wheel. <laughs> we see right there we already have one ruby, so wait, wait, wait. Hi, Link. I finished the fishing rod I was making. I thought I'd give it to you first thing in the morning, but my dad said you just wait until Link comes to get it. So that's why I didn't bring it to you. Dad's out today, so would you ask my mom about it? I think she's by the river. <laughs> I also want to mention out that Link wear is wearing sandals. I mean, not that it's a bad thing. I like sandals. But... I just think that's a cool thing to sh oh, okay. see. Like, how many characters in a game actually wear sandals instead of actual shoes? Boots or anything else. It was a baby's cradle made of finely woven tree bark. That was such a misfortune. How far could it have drifted, I wonder? Probably not very far because this water literally goes nowhere into the village, so I did not mean to pick that up. Um, yeah. Yo, Link, yo, up here. I want to talk to you. Press A while holding ZL so we can chat. Hey, that's. There you go. Uh, over here, yeah. What's wrong with him? Bro, you need a bandana for your forehead, man. I'm sorry, but you need like four bandanas to cover up that forehead. And you... And why does he have such a big forehead? And how is it possible that his forehead is bigger than Vegeta's forehead from Dragon Ball? Like, how is that even possible? <laughs> Maybe you can teach my tykes that you gotta press A while ZL targeting to talk to people from a distance. They don't get it. So listen, why don't you climb up those vines here, Link? <laughs> Yo, there you are. Check this out. You know Sarah at the general store? Well, isn't that her cat over there? He's just been sitting there next to my house having a staring contest with the creek. You don't suppose he's thinking he's gonna catch a fish, do you? <laughs> a cat can't catch no fish. Actually, if you want to be validly, validly correct, cats can catch fish. I mean, but in this game, probably not. But still. Still, if we were going on accuracy, a cat could catch fish. They don't mind for some reason. Here's something I don't understand but cats. They don't like getting wet, but yet they can drink water and be fine with getting a little bit wet from drinking water. It's like, what? Just what? Anyway, that's not what I was meaning to tell you about. I want you to take a look at something. See that grass growing around the edge of that rock? Haven't I seen you whistling with that stuff? It's weed. It's secretly weed. Wait, what? Oh, why did it? <laughs> I figured it was weed. Really rare to see growing in a place like that. So okay, like when sh when Zelda gamer when she said that, I laughed. I was on the ground. I was off my bed laughing. I like this music. I like it better than the one you call your horse with. Miss. Okay. 
Did you hear the monkey? Hello? The monkey sounded like a squeaking bed. You guys are being like, Sean? Are you thinking dirty again? And most likely 100% maybe. It's a 50-50. Well, she's yes, yes. Well, because, because she's about to have right, another maybe. child, though. God, Probably, or else that, or she's just bad. Who knows? I like the look at Lynn's face. He's like, Whoa! This is awesome! And also, I mean, it is a fishing rod with bobber and hook. I mean, I would like that because I love fishing, personally. I love fishing. If I could go fishing all day, I would. But then again, I do have to make videos for you guys. I don't want to let you guys go in the corner, leave you guys in the dark, and never come back. And also, you attach, you can't always live off of, um, food you can buy. But, yeah, if I could go fishing all day, every day, I would. But you'll catch a larger variety of fish with me. It is a little unpolished. My son Colin made this under the instruction of his father. Can use it if you like. If I like. Yes, I will. I will use it. But first, I need to get some money for the slingshot, which we just hit this down, so we're good. I mean, I swear, the way Link falls from heights and don't shatter his ankles, like. If you were to fall from that height, your ankles would have been shattered. They would have been done for. You got ten rupees. And five rupees. Yay. Okay. I am not killing myself like most people would. I because this will probably get a lot of health taken away when you do that, but you know. At least ankles shattered, not like, um, like, probably. Take the rupee. Collect all the money! I mean, there's always going to be like that one hate comment that's like, You should have collected the dang green rupee! And I'll... I'll be like, don't hate. Okay, you got 30. Oh. Okay, okay, I really should have thought this out. Okay. Mm. Right, I don't here. think we'll things out. Because why not? Coming from the cat. Get this. And just wait for the bobber to go under, and then we're gonna get him out of the fish. Ow. That was way too fast. That would not happen in real life. Yeah, most likely it'd take an hour to catch a fish. You caught a green gill alone. So in the Link universe, they call it Green Gill. Like, and the rig fish look like would be technically a salmon in real life. Like what? Like it how they like renamed the fish in Legend of Zelda instead of calling it like a bluegill, eleven inches, or like a salmon. But no, they call it Gringo and Reek Fish, which is cool. I like it because those are actually 
names that they had to think up in their mind, along with all the other characters. I just like the detail of all in every single game. I like the Link's expression. He's like, Whoa! <laughs> But yeah, that would be every cat steals your catch, runs away, and you'll never see the cat ever again. Design of Link's slingshot. We know how to do that. Aim with blah blah blah. Okay. See you again soon. Bye. I don't care about you or your cat or the whole shop. That was a little too far that time. <laughs> yeah, a lot. I mean, I like animal, but Link, why would you say that? <laughs> I just delivered something to your room. Oh, I see you got the fishing rod. Colin will be pleased. And it works better than you would think, right? Well, have a good one. Just leaves you. I really want to know who does Link's makeup. Those wings are perfect. <laughs> Link has a slingshot. Whoa. Yeah. Well, you've had enough money to buy it, Link. But the little demon baby did nothing. Yeah, all I think is when I see that smaller child is Demon Baby. Operations complete. Oh wow, this is great. Let's see how powerful that slingshot is. Hit the targets and those scarecrows. I can't believe you two brats are so obsessed about this thing. It just shows what little boys you both still are. These two idiots will never shut up about it, so I guess I'll just have to show them, Link. That's a great shot. <laughs> yeah, when I was... Uh... Uh, it's at a gamer's house. I actually shot the body of the scarecrow, which I wasn't supposed to do. I was supposed to aim for the head. Which I did not know until she told me. And I was like... Ugh. That's amazing, Link. The slingshot manual said that it's easier to hit things if you hold ZL while you aim it. Did you call us obsessed with this thing? You're the only member right in the manual. <laughs> Even though that was not part of it, we're still gonna go with it, so why not? I missed. I don't think I've missed, missed any of the okay. targets. Just like that demon baby is scary. Okay. 
I swear, damn baby, it's like one of those ones that, that will, once when you're asleep, be right in there, holding a knife, and be like, it's time to sleep forever, Ling. Just stab you. Until you're dead. Gushing out blood. <laughs> Yeah, about this. For some reason, I don't know if it's just how immature my mind is. Or, well, no, not really. But, uh, Beth over there has, you could probably tell, has a crush on Link. And also. Probably dreams of inappropriate dreams with Link. Not gonna say it out loud because I'm trying to keep this channel family friendly. At least. Seriously, lately these monkeys have been coming out of the woods and playing tricks on us. We want to get them good. Come on, teach us how to use the sword. I will. Yes. That... <laughs> no idea what that voice was. Yeah, the thrust move. We all know. That is probably some. That's why says Beth over there probably has inappropriate dreams about her and Link doing. You know what? I'm th doing the naughty naughty. Not going to say it because again, trying to keep this. Freaking video family friendly, not age restricted. Stab. <laughs> Stab more like a first. Oh, like, just amazing. Since you're at it, how about you show us that other move? You know, that little twirly thing you call a spin attack. Like it's hard to briefly hold B and release it. Like it's hard to briefly hold B and release it. That was not what I wanted to do. <laughs> So this is an episode. If you guys do like, check out Zelda Game Four Five Six. This has been Sean Hines the Gamer. See you in the next video. Peace out.